All right, so I have wired everything up, written a script, and uh, just clear everything out. Uh, so first of all, let's take a look at the script because it's not very complicated, and then we can get back to our setup. So uh, this is the script. Uh, basically, just uh, enables uh, three GPIO pins. Uh, sets all of their directions as out and then blinks them uh, one by one so that is what we are going to take a look at now over to the camera which is sitting right over the Heike 960 and the uh, audio mezzanine board we have our three LEDs plugged in with the colored wires the black ones the ground and you can see two of them are uh, lit up because I was uh, running the script to test it and they remain lit up after I exited it uh, and then uh, what we can notice that we have two LEDs here we have our switch here to f uh, switch between 5 volts and 3.3 volts I have it at 3.3 volts and uh, what I can say straight away that I have seen uh, brighter LEDs or 3.3 volts the only thing that makes sense is uh, that the current uh, supply must not be as much as some of the other boards after stepping it up that is the only thing I can think about right now apart from that it actually works pretty well so let's go ahead and uh, run our script uh, and the script pretty much runs uh, like it should the again the red one is a bit uh, light uh, I mean I mean it's a light it's just not as bright uh, it's a bit dull and apart from that it works fine now if I brighten it up by switching to 5 volts uh, weird stuff starts to happen with me um, well it's now working as you can see uh, at the end when the green uh, la the, when the first green LED should uh, turn off it's it doesn't turn off completely there's still some uh, I don't know maybe it's leaked voltage or whatever there's still some that remains uh, and it this is happening with few of the pins so I don't know maybe it is a configuration setting or something like that or maybe uh, there is uh, the uh, there's some uh, electronics that have gone wrong, uh, wrong on this board could be anything because this board was never again as I said meant to be on sale these were pro prototype boards uh, that were actually uh, made in bulk to test in house and then uh, everyone like lost all their documents and stuff uh, and they had to sell them so again this is a really nice little board um, uh, I hope I could have gotten the audio stuff to work because that would have been interesting apart from that the step up works fine maybe it works actually better if you have like a low power sensor connected to it uh, that doesn't draw as much current as these LEDs uh, and stuff like that so yes a niche, nice little board maybe in some time in the future when all the uh, as I said you know, C and Lib MRA and all of that stuff starts to work uh, we can get some uh, groove connectors and some I squared C stuff working on here so that was about it thank you so much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed this small little board that is on sale I, I do request you to go ahead and get it if you have a nine uh, a dragon board or a 96 board it is extremely cheap and it's going to go out uh, of um, sale pretty soon so yeah limited limited amounts available for this board uh, check them out uh, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all in the next one